song you make me wanna roll my windows down and cruise what's up everybody i'm michael and i'm amanda and we're doing a new youtube series called get to know us and i mean a lot of you guys know us from youtube or from instagram you know that we love jesus and that we love relationships um but that's probably pretty much all you know so when we were first dating how did, how did we even meet baby we actually ended up in a theater class together with about 12 students 8 a.m 8 a.m um and so one day uh, or the first day of class i was in the theater class and we were just going around doing names, it was early, and I heard uh, this beautiful voice say, hi, I'm Amanda, and I was like, what's that beautiful voice coming from? I was like, whoa, hello, how you doing? Uh, am I seeing what I think I'm seeing at eight in the morning? Which I was, but at that time she was in a relationship, so I wasn't messing with that. We were just friends, just friends in theater class, but uh, eventually the relationship she was in lasted no longer. And <laughs> soon after that, I was like, hey, Shouty, what's up? <laughs> Except he wasn't exactly like, hey, Shouty, what's up? I wasn't like, if someone comes up to you like, hey, Shouty, what's up? You should definitely avoid them. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Oh, for a long time. Um, I remember yeah. we were in the cafeteria and he like came by me. It was the very end of the semester. It was like finals week or something. And he was like, Amanda, I know that we became friends over the semester, and I just, <laughs> we we can't just fall off after this. Like, it can't happen. We have to continue being friends. Like, yeah. I realized that, like, like, we have to. And he was. <laughs> I was so serious. Cause we had, he was we, so bold. We had never crossed paths before, like, that semester, and then that semester happened, and I was just like. He um, was so serious though. He was like, Amanda, we have to keep being we friends. Have to keep like being it tough. can't Yeah. I put my grown man voice on. I'm not gonna do it on camera. It was it was so like convincing though. I was like, I guess so. I guess it really is that important. Yeah. <laughs> and then we got married. So, you know <laughs> Something no, worked. Yes, note to note to the women out there. If the guy wants you, he will he will he will pursue you. Oh, for sure, for sure. Like, he was he was right there. He was like If you ever hear a guy say right girl, wrong timing, that's crap. Trust me, because I've used it on people that were not Amanda. <laughs> and uh Right girl. <laughs> right timing. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> so the um the timing was not the greatest, but it was good enough. I was like, hey, we need to keep talking. And so we ended up just staying friends for a little while and then dating. And so then after we started dating, our first date was at church. Yeah, it was it was a lot of fun. I was really excited. I remember we were not Facebook official yet and I didn't think that we were like boyfriend, girlfriend yet. It was our first date. Yeah. And so he like, we drove up to the church and he was like, how should I introduce you? Should I be like, this is my girl, this is my girlfriend? I was like, don't just just like we're, we're, we're going together you know like a day but I wouldn't say that I'm your girlfriend you know what I mean but like he kind of he kind of like hinted at that yeah way. I did because meanwhile at the church people were like <laughs> y'all are together what and then looking at like people like on the side of me like good job, good job. And I was just talking about that. we're not official yet it was exciting it was exciting and I remember um I remember him telling his brother, right away, you texted it, your brother. Mom. You, was that the first person? Was your mom? Pretty sure. Because I was like, hey, mom, there's this girl. And before this, like, I didn't date around. Like, uh, we, we started dating second semester of sophomore year. I hadn't dated, talked to anyone since, like, really seriously since junior year of high school. Mm -hmm. You know, so I, I took a long break. Because the next person I wanted to date, I wanted to marry. And so... Amanda came along and I was texting my mom. So there's this girl and she was like, what? What's her name? Send me a picture, her social. I just told a few people close to me, but I was more so like, you know, shy. I was just really shy in the beginning. It took me a while to like, 
I, I knew that Michael was right. I, I felt a lot of peace about him. He had a good head on his shoulders. He was all about Jesus. Um, I wouldn't say that he was as mature as he is now or oh, as strong in the faith as he is now, but he was definitely more spiritually sound than I was. I was like, I can see him leading me. He knows where he's going. He's confident. Like, I felt so much peace about it, and, and we had already talked, um, had spiritual discussions and spiritual conversations before that even began. Um, and he was the one who introduced me to gospel music. I used to just listen to contemporary Christian, yeah. or, or I'll just listen to secular music. I was like, girl, we're going to throw a little... Throw a little flavor, ah! you know, some Thai trivia, yeah. some Kurt Franklin, a little some Myron Myr Butler, Myron Butler, yeah. our Fred Hemp. Yes. Y'all know. Yeah. If y'all don't know, then y'all need to let me know so I can let you know. But then after a while, like I was just really, um, really excited. Had to tell everybody about how our relationship was going, really public, and everything like that. Um, yeah. That gives you a little sneak peek into who we are a little bit and where we came from and I'm really excited to do more videos like this and just tell yes. people a little bit more about who we are and everything. And so if yeah. you guys have any questions specifically uh, that you want us to tackle or uh, any questions about us specifically that you want us to, to take on, then let me know or let her know. Put it in the comments. Yep, below. Um, it's really weird because there are no comments below us right now, but <laughs> whenever we do the video on YouTube, it'll be a comment box. Yeah. Yeah, guys, I hope you have a wonderful day. <laughs> Love y'all. Bye.